Hi everybody, I'm the Reluctant Reviewer. And I'm KP83. And here we are with a really quick review of something you might have seen on Cupy's channel. It is Bright Fairy Friends, thank goodness, something in the doll aisle, on the shelf. It's kind of mystery and not mystery. Well, it is mystery because you don't know which doll you're getting. And I know that upsets some people, but I used to buy trading cards and I never knew if I was going to have a whole pack full of doubles. And about now, they probably are the same price, $9 <laughs> to buy That's a true. pack of trading cards. So I understand that, but uh, yeah, give it to somebody else true. if you get a double. Give it to a friend. Yeah, so Bright Furry Friends are by Friend Rise. Um, you may have heard this information, but just in case you only watch my mom channel or you missed my video, uh, which is totally fine, <laughs> that here's just some basic information about it. So they're from Funrise, as I said. There's 12 fairy tastic dolls to collect. Um, they are $9.99, mm -hmm. pretty affordable. And besides just having a doll in here, this acts as a nightlight. Which I like. I really like that whole idea. It plays on the fairy jar concept. Mm -hmm. um, they are available at Walmart and also Amazon and Target mm -hmm. will be getting them as well. So they are, they'll be available at most of the major retailers. And I, I know I read this on Cupid's video, but I might as well read it again. Bright Fairy Friends Shine Together, also known as BFF, get it? Um, from a magical land where BFFs radiate light with a sprinkling of fairy dust, creating a world that's cheerfully bright. All the very best friends, whether near or far, they set out on adventures regaining magic in their fairy jar. In the whimsical forest, these fairy friends call home where they grow and blossom as one and never alone. So friendship, um, helping each other out. Uh, there are little videos, very, very short little videos on um, the website. So have a look at those and then you get to know what kind of fairy you have. Yeah. Um, this was Penny when we opened that one. So I'm wondering what this one is. Right now I have this on the uh, little um, switch that every time something touches it or goes near it, it turns on. There's also one that's a more constant and it stays on, I forget how long now. 20 minutes, I 20 think. 20 minutes and then it turns off. So it's a great little night light. Yeah. Okay, so you have Penny. Let's see who we have. And you can replace the batteries in the jar, but not the doll. Ooh. Oh, it's a different one! It's not in there! <laughs> Oh, let's see. Can I tell who she is? I think she's Sunny. Let me make sure there's not one on this side. She has orange hair showing, which means she's Sunny. Ta da! <gasps> oh, she's let's cute. open her. Okay. And let's try to open that. Use those muscles. Use those muscles. There we go. Ah, okay. It's sunny. She's orange. Her little, I've got to fix her little bangs. But she's cute. Let's see. Does she light up? There's a little light back there. Yeah, she lights up. And I didn't notice it changed colors on yours. It did. She has a cute face, though. She's very cute. Isn't she like the main girl? I don't remember who the main girl was. All right, she has her doll stand. She's really cute. She does have, are those decal eyes? They, are, um, they, they look like they look like decal eyes, eyes. Yeah. but they're cute because they're really big eyes. And she has her pretty little braid in back, and she lights up. Not just the jar; she also lights up her wings. I like her hair color. I like that she has like a normal skin, like a natural normal skin tone. Okay, so she does have a sun mark on her cheek. Where's your mark on yours? Ah, how is that penny? Um, I don't know exactly, <laughs> but it is. Okay. Um, we need to look at the uh, video and then find all about her likes. Her likes and dislikes and see what she likes. What are her accessories? Her accessories? Would you like to open the accessories? Sure. Okay. I'm going to let you open them. So you have four accessories here. Are there four? Oh, I remember what her accessories were. We have the BFF 
barrettes. Ah, okay. These are series one. That means there's going to be another series. Hopefully. Okay. Were yours the same color? Uh, yes. Okay. I mean, both of the pieces were the same color. I think that might have been a different color. Mm. This is her... Her jar. Her, her magic jar. With the little hole there so you can put some string on it and put it around your neck. And she could take it wherever she goes. Oh, mine were yellow. I think the hearts were yellow. Oh, yours are yellow. Oh, for her wings? No. Oh, yeah. They match her wings. Oh. There we go. Good eyes. We have a comb. An orange comb. There you go. Yay! But I don't want to take her hair out of her braid because no. it's so cute. Yeah. And she's got this really short little fringe. It's kind of neat looking. It, they did it pretty well. It could have gone terribly wrong. It could but have they gone did it pretty good. Wrong. When you look at their, them together, yeah, she's definitely more she's pinky. Pink. She's pink, but if you can see, see? They're best Super friends cute. forever. So it's the luck of the draw, what you get. But this is kind of neat that we do, did get two different kinds. Yeah. Um, so since we already kind of told you about the dolls, I guess that's it, right? Well, you can say it again for here. You can talk about their armature. Oh, that's right. So for the Bright Fairy Friends, they have a limited articulation. Like their arms will go up and down, their mm -hmm. leg will go up and down, and of course their head will turn left and right. You're not going to find like any like swiveling joints here. Uh, they don't have like a torso joint or anything. So they are kind of basic in the articulation department, but, but so it cute. is the first one. little hands like that. Yeah, it is. They do have cute, uh, cute things, and that is something to point out. It's not just like, like hands that are just boring and mm -hmm. normal and flat, you know, kind of like a right. fork. Uh, they they do have some like movement to them. Like a typical fairy. Yeah. Okay. So that's basically it on these guys. Um, look for them on your shelves. Pick one up. Yeah, and let us know which one you get when you open it up. And uh, watch the little webisodes, and we'll talk to you later. Bye.